Unless they actually get double blue. Need to get behind them. So no, this uh, base game map. There are no modern maps in this uh, mod. You may have not like gone there, but like this, you know, you fight up here. You can sometimes spawn down here as well, depending. How do we get down here? There's three pathways down. There's one there. Over there, of course. And then one here. They're in Morocco now. Wait, where, where do they usually are? Huh? Morocco, Egypt. Is it ain't the same thing? <laughs> what are we waiting for? Two guys are somewhere on the field. Oh no. I think they may be stuck. No? Where are they? I'm from the Balkans or um, ex Yugoslavian. Looks to me like there's someone stuck in the sand. You're a gypsy from Germany. Where the hell am I getting shot from? There is an enemy in the sand. <laughs> There's two enemies in the sand. Well... This is what you get from playing on um, a thousand men on the field, I guess. Yeah, look at that. Well. Death by sand, apparently. Except they don't die. Oh god. Was this gonna be a thing? Are they running away? What's even worse, they didn't like lose morale and retreat. There's not, there's not really anything we can do, is there? Yeah, there's nothing we can do. I mean, someone's getting shot in their feet, I believe. That's about it. Oh, of course.
We're a huge fan of Mountain Blade games. There's only two. Well, that's a lie. There's more of them. But you know what I mean. I'm playing Warband for years. Yeah, I kind of wish I could. I was thinking of doing another Prophecy of Pandora playthrough, but uh, the game just doesn't want to run. Well, there's a. Uh, like, if you don't count uh, the. Um, DLCs or expansions for Warband, then I guess, yeah, they are three. But we did win, well, almost won that battle. So there was enemies in the sand. There's the fire and sword and the musket one. I didn't play those, they were PC exclusive. Yeah, true. Oh, you, if you didn't play Prophecy of Pandora, you're missing out, man. That's the best. I don't play a Warband without that mod. Warband will need like shit compared to that. But I'm gonna end this here. It's a bit, it already is past midnight. I'm an hour extra into the stream. I was thinking of doing Prophecy of Pandora, but I can't get the game to run perfectly. Maybe once I get an Intel processor. And different motherboard and all that, they might actually run fine. They should add official mod support to next gen consoles. Yeah, it could be. Well, at least it, uh, for Warband, it would be a lot easier than uh, Ben Law, that's for sure. Because in Warband, you just download the mod, and there's. When you launch the game, you can just choose that mod, and that's it. There's no, like, you don't need to fuck around with, like, 10 different mods to get one to work, you know? If this, like, I have, like, I have these five, then 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25 mods installed. Do you know a samurai mod, a Gekko Kujo? I think it's the most popular one. Oh, another one. Right, I could find this one as well. I replenish actually. Okay, there we go. Come back here. What do you want, stranger? Who are you? I don't know who, which one of the people at Tail World thought that uh, doing a voice acting would be a great idea. Yeah, see, I come crew. Probably in a day or two, I'll stream this one again. Then I'm gonna move on to the ranging god thing. Decrease morale shock. Range damage, decrease morale shot, range damage, range damage, decrease morale. Uh, I guess uh, decrease range damage taken. Decrease mount movement speed. The rest is fine. Doors! Troops! Sergeants! No! I'll beat these guys and then we're off. They only have like shit tier infantry. Oh my god, that cow actually got them. They got them.
Okay, no, 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 they are moving towards us. Run away. And we're not going to make it to our destination. So black, I can't tell. Even though they are. Oops. The color should be brown, right? Something brownish. Then again, it is nighttime, I guess. It makes sense. I can't make out if, um, you know, they're higher tier or lower tier. Considering how uh, easy we're killing them, they're probably loaded here. <laughs> yeah, clan members. Yeah, most of these are loaded here. It's actually a good thing there is no friendly fire. There is a mod that actually adds in friendly fire, but... Uh, that would be... Um, It would be awful for me. I don't know how I would do the battle then. Or for this in particular. We already do Romans, we only use archers to actually pull the enemy off the hill or something when they camp. The rest we deal with the infantry. What the second? We got to do something? What? We ain't got to do anything, man. Or gal, we just have to die. Pretty much it. We got to butcher the empires. We kind of already did. There's only the southern, the northern. Well, the northern empire has one city, and the western empire has what? Three. That's gonna be done in the next uh, stream because the vote is 56. Nine votes. It's 56 to do the Varangian Guard playthrough next. So I'm gonna do one more of these, then I'm gonna do that. We're gonna assert dominance in the next one. Oh. 74 piercing damage. You fucking bastard. We don't have to butcher the Carthaginians, not the empires. No, I did. I did enough butchering of the Carthaginians, I think. For now, till I play Rome 2 again or something, or even Medieval 2, where we fight Tunisia. If that's the faction, I can't. I can't recall. Caliphate something. Uh, First, we do have to butcher the Ratman as the Lizardman in Warhammer 3. That's next up as well. Okay, there we go. Mop them up. So, I'm gonna guess that's the last of them. Probably not. But we already beat two big Dacian, Dacian armies. That should be it. Next time I stream this, yeah, let's see. Southern Empire, one, two, three. 
There were two castles left. No, three. There's a castle and two cities left. Northern Empire has one castle. These we can just leave to the AI to mop up. Uh, I guess two castles and two cities. Yeah, they have this. Like, we're at the point where we can just rush in and outright kill, him, kill off a faction in one war. If we piece everything else out so we're not distracted by anything. I mean, we've been there for a while. Look at that. 20k over 6k. Cities don't exist. Western Empire is screwed. Britannia. Northern, yeah, they're they're all fucked. Northern Empire ain't giving up though. Fucking that maniacs. They almost deserve this, so I'll leave them be. Okay. West Rome, Roman Empire is non-existent. These guys are kicking their asses. With war with Southern Empire that might pop up somewhere. What else is there? Nation Batania. Right, at this point I, get, I think I can just let my guys lead armies and beat the enemy. I don't need to do anything. Yeah, pretty much we're fine. I do remember I used up a lot of the money to get the other guys in here. Or persuade them to join the kingdom. I don't really want to go down here because the time I get down there, the war is probably going to be over. Or we're going to get to clearly a war on by Batania or some shit like that. You know, the usual things. God damn, the Nord Northern Empire just doesn't want to die. Like I said, I almost want to, like, leave him there, you know. They earned it, for fuck's sakes, at this point. Food. You know, we gotta drag someone into a war, someone who can actually do something. Increase charge damage. Eh? I don't think that's gonna be all that useful. Army of a thousand men just going to raid. So useful. These guys are gathering. These guys are gathering as well. Unfortunately, they're gonna lose this down here. Could help them out a little bit. Unfortunately, by me having more Romans in the army, it means that we're not going to have the skirmish game advantage. So the horseman uh, idea is not really... Well, won't be happening. I'm going to gather as many of them as I can and maybe smash or clear out the Carthaginians entirely.
Okay, let's see. I don't care if you lose that. That's Dacian, probably. Dacian's attacking us. Traveling to defend. Traveling to... There. I guess let's just push him through here. Fucking Discord all over the place. Give me a second. There we go. There's a band party of 200 guys over there. Stop there, stranger. I bid you peace. And oh my god, the voice acting so awful. Like, why do this? I mean, this game made by Turkish people, but uh, yeah, Turkish developer team. Surely they could have found some, you know, Europeans to do. This morale shock, strange. What? The fuck's up with this? He doesn't have a ha half of his face over there. Yeah, that's. This is one of those bugs that was early, early, really early in the game. You can see his eyes over there. We have a ton of infantry on the field, not so many archers. These small skirmishers as well. Go! Soldier! Troop! Sergeant! Soldiers! They are kind of close to the sorority. Charge straight in them, into them. Two fucking morons. Yeah, let's charge hoplites and sacred ban. Let the boss will go wrong with that, right? Though. This yeah, that's an enemy.
Now, if only the cat wasn't so dumb to run through them, that would be nice. Is the only one loss in our entire army so far? Sure, how well we're gonna do with siege? Who the hell is left? Of course, cavalry. Just like, ah, this is all over with. I don't need to move. They should have better spears than we do. Like this one, for example. Or the Romans do, I should say. But we're not gonna take it. Not much of a point. We one shot most things anyway. If they don't block. Alright, let me check this as well. Okay, we lost one of those. One of those. Have a look at the rest of the map, see what's happening. They were sieging that. It's probably Dacians. Probably Dacians. Surely. The Bullis Castle. Okay, there. What you doing? They're going to defend. There's 700 of them. Might, they might be able to defend that. But these guys, a thousand. You son of a bitch. And I was gonna leave them at peace. They'll leave it be to survive or some shit like that. Look at that. I called it. Like, as soon as I got over there in the desert, someone declared war on us. Motherfuckers might even get a castle. Get over there. Quick, 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 quick. Game, let me click on them. Fucking know with an empire. If I recall, that's the empire we failed to convert most of the people from. This is perfect. This is literally the perfect starting position. Yeah, I can deal with that. What's up, Jonas? How are you doing? How's New Year treating you? So far, at least. It's just killing my own people now. God damn it! Still have holding. Why well, are you orthodox like myself? Yeah. Or oh, hold I leave. Whatever. We have our new um, our Christmas is on seventh now. Saturday. Then we have a New Year's on thirteen to fourteen. 
How strong is our army? Uh, we can beat anything, more or less. Without taking too many casualties. Or any fault, if, if any, I should say. We have 417 men, which are all elites. Plus some um, you know, random parties with us. Oops. Now I can't tell which is this. Okay, this guy's on my side. Just stop skirmishing. Stay there. Is not too bad, but there's only what was there 270 300 guys on their side. Easy, there you can see the army I have or the party. Literally, just elite enemy troops, basically. There's not like 3,000 men in them. That could suck. Well, let's get rid of them for the fourth time, I think. more of them in there. No, they fucked off. And parlay now. Actually, you could yeah, leave that. Who is it now? Some random clan. Apparently. beat them into submission or just take the last of them. Maybe they won't survive this time. Or they'll find another poorly defended city and just take it. Southern Imperiums get got wrecked literally. I think I took all of his uh well most of his vassals. A big chunk of them at least. Yeah, I want to. I want us to get into a fight. No, battalions are fucked as well. They're all kind of crap now. So this, that's why this is the last stream for this playthrough. We have no opposition at this point. How about you go do something else, you piece of crap? Are coming here. This is a bit overkill, isn't it? Oh, let's just all resolve it. A bit overkill. Tetsudo standard. Decrease tank and range damage. Okay, this is the one uh, one better than we, we had. Taking decrease shield damage. 
Uh, let's give him the Testudo one. Oh, no, they, uh, we should give that to this guy. Or the movement speed. Mm, we don't really need our infantry to move fast, right? Well, no, not really. Lying there for a second. Yeah, it looks it died on my end as well. Probably enough. Well, let's uh, let's leave these guys in there. Oh, no, that's not gonna work, is it? Not really. He's connected a lot of creators. Amazon having issues, apparently. Oh, would you look at this guy? A mercenary, of course. Of course, the two armies that were over here got uh, wiped or disbanded. Oh god, it's happening again. Yeah. Just switch, switch to YouTube. There is a link to my YouTube channel somewhere on Twitch. Well, I guess I'll link. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's sell the rest of these. Peace, of course. Yeah, much better on, on YouTube. Might be even higher quality. A little bit. These. Wait, we had six of them. I do hate prisoners in this game. Ah, oh, they're over capacity, of course. Uh, why would they not be? We had six or five guys and they ran away from here to here. Of course. Okay, let's see. Uh, I, if, when I go here, Batania is going to declare war or some shit like that. I'm not going to even go down there. <laughs> we kind of need to. Oh, god damn it. I don't really get peace with any of them. We could maybe go to war with the Batania. And the Sturgeons or Nord Northmen. Eh. I don't really want to go all the way up there to take that. The problem with Batania is they have this. But if I do declare war on them, we could probably peace out with one of them. i uh, just expand this, let them go on their own. I want them to do my job for me. <laughs> okay, neither one of these guys has them, I think. Which being weird. That's nothing new. That's why I dislike Twitch. We have a lot of shit that doesn't work. It's a bit annoying. Now it's fixed. I might as well go up. We did beat a bunch of Dacian armies, but they probably don't have anything to combat us. The 
that guy, yes, he did just switch. Mercenary. What up? You're running away like bitches. I mean, if I was patient enough, I could probably beat that. They have a thousand infantry. Thousands crap. That is a thousand crap. It's all infantry, yeah, basically. Which is the problem because infantry have shields. <laughs> you know, who would have guessed, right? Uh, now let's see where they're gonna go. Traveling to Lycia to besiege. What? They're traveling to the village to besiege. No, that's not right. You might need to pick up some more guys to beat that. Wish I did just spend a whole lot of shit. Six days to get here, five days. Well, they're probably gonna go besiege this. It's still saying the same thing. How long did we play this game? Okay, so it's this is the 10th stream. So, 30 hours. A bit more, somewhere around there. In-game days, it's, uh, let's see. Thousand and a half. We almost have half the map. Oh, look, we're at war with the Northmen as well. Can we piece anybody out? We could maybe piece Daesh out, but we're going to be giving them money, which I don't really particularly care. We have millions in the bank. Give me those two guys. Yeah, they're going there to besiege. Was. I mean, I could sit there and, uh, you know, get the defensive battle, but they're probably gonna leave. Or another army is gonna show up, and yeah, he he's there. I think they're going up. Ortega Castle. Uh, no, that's here somewhere. Yeah, that. Where the fuck did they get this? What? Ah, it's all blue. That's the problem. Now I whined about the colors in the in the mod not being to my liking, and they yeah, it's not worse, but it's not better. You know, Southern Empire being the red ones instead of the Western Empire, the Northern Empire being black, Scythia being uh. Light blue. Look at the designs. These guys being white. Brown. Blue. Another shade of blue. Another shade of blue. Like three shades of blue for fuck's sakes. There's more colors. Did they actually start the fight there? Get in there. Did pull the garrison out. You always, if there's a siege, you always want to wait for them to attack, so you can pull out the garrison as well. Get some assistance. Or cannon fodder. More like cannon fodder. Yeah. Not the best map. Your shield damage taken. Range damage. Let me see here. Do we have increased mountain movement speed? There we go. Uh, we might as well camp the hill here. 
if I can place my units. The fuck? Ah, that's probably the end of the deployment zone or something. Looks like it. Okay, give me a second. Okay, you can stay there. They're gonna have a shield of the cav. No, this is... So they cannot stand there, but they can stand up here. Makes sense. Which is dying right now. To you too, Andrew. It's dying all over the place, apparently. Just switch to YouTube. YouTube is our savior. Whatever. Four saunches. They actually don't have as much cav as a tall they would have. They dying for you? Well, depends. It's probably like they might have a schedule like um, downtime or some shit. So it's like depending on where you are, depending on which servers your country uses and all that. You know, all the technical stuff. Tell if I angle these correctly. And they're coming out. Oh, right. We're not on the attacking side for once. And I need to angle these a little bit better. Surprised I was a bit I was able to drag that out. You know how it is. A rock in the way. You fuck up your formation immediately. Swordmaker shield wall. 400 infantry. But you can just run through apparently. God, that cavalry doing stupid shit as always. Yes, let's charge the spearmen. We still have their peel them out. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, no, no, stop moving backwards. That's not what you're supposed to do. Not towards my skirmisher cow, come on. Dreatic Honor Guard. Oops. What you want with the small folks? Okay, get, the, get them back. Now let's see. Now I can't tell if this is a banner or is it an actual tug of roaming core. Yeah, this is a banner. Like it's not uh, one of those like Roman things where they have the you know eagle on it, standards and whatnot. Already kill like all of their elite units, they have mostly trash now. Yeah, clan warriors, fortunately, they do have shields. How dare they!
Right, I'm not gonna be able to hit any of these. They're all gonna block. Beauty of the realistic battle mode. Which might be just, you know, stamping down on uh, people who have their bitrate too high. Because I am streaming all at um, 7800 or 7900, something like that. Which is a big no-no, of course. Maybe they just got trash coming in. It wasn't just me. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if that happens as well. Help? Many soldiers do you have? How many soldiers do we have? Currently on the field, 493. We killed 800. In the party, I can have 470 at the moment. That's the party capacity on my end now. I think the streamers have 50k. Oh, they got their panties a bunch then. Their livelihood is at stake and all that. Now this mod, if we play with Eagle Rising, they have special units that can increase your party size. So it's not just renown and uh, clan level and all that. game called Mountain Blade Bannerlord. Oh, wow, that's right. Yeah, it's in the in the title. So is the Eagle Rising mod in the title. It's behind them. That we have a Falksman on our side. Might be time for me to actually uh, give a multiplayer uh, a whirl again. Oh, that's he's on our side. You're gonna get blocked by a shield, or you're gonna get blocked by your own guy in the way. Killed 1400, and we lost 120. Not bad. Rather like, yeah, most of them are low with you. I think the like initial challenge in any of the wars you do in this game is just at the beginning. Once you like get through their elite units, it becomes pretty easy. Sixteen kills. That's pretty good, actually. Let's make him a party leader. Stewardship, leadership, tactics. Mosh pit. Oh, this game. Mosh pit is in the name. Ban Lord. <laughs> I mean, Bug Lords. Not Ban Lord. Because it seems they do run into each and every single bug there is. Okay, 
Okay, can we use any of these? Not really. Steel and flesh? What the fuck is that? Isn't this a mobile game? This is a mobile game. No, I don't play any mobile games. The only mobile game I would I do play is Tetris, but even that requires an online connection. Same game, but on mobile. That's, that's hard to believe. Really the same? Let's see. Gandon. Look at that. There's Mountain Blade on a fucking phone. The animations look better, dude. Oh my god, is a mobile game better than... It, it sure does look... It sure does look like a mobile game is better than what uh, Tailwords managed to do. <laughs> What about the second game? The tutorials for beginners. Yeah, this is Mountain Blade on a mobile phone. Look at that. It sure looks like it's better than the fucking uh, shit we're playing on PC. <laughs> oh my god. PC gaming. Yeah, that's finest. I don't know what to tell you, man. I mean, this is always gonna run better and all that, and still, like, playing games on a mobile phone is not for me. The screen's too small. God fucking... <laughs> oh, God, I'm gonna uninstall this... You have 4,000 people in your castle? You don't really need that many troops here. Or like... The wages would be too high. I mean, if I disbanded all the armies... Okay, this this bugged out again. Lovely. 